we want our simulations to be as accurate as possible. And for that purpose, we have now developed a new visualization accuracy settings, which accounts for reflections and diffractions. This is especially useful in complex environments like this warehouse, where you have many features like this behind the corner areas, some shelves, some pillars maybe. Uh, so let's look how it works. Let's place an access point in this hallway and we can see that I actually have a coverage gap here behind the corner and if I move the access point around it doesn't really help. So what I can do, I can actually now check my visualization accuracy settings by going to the bottom right, opening the menu and I can see that currently my accuracy is set to high and this setting doesn't account for the reflections and diffractions effect. What I can do, I can drag this to maximum and now the calculations are run again and now the reflections are, and diffractions are accounted for. So looking at the same uh, corner area, you can see now that this is actually now covered. So if I move the access point a bit, you can see that the calculations take a bit more time, but also the heat map is now a bit different. Uh, so reflections and diffractions effect is uh, very useful when you have complex environments, but for most cases where you have wide spaces and uh, less features, uh, high accuracy is uh, more than sufficient and you can also notice that the updating of the uh, heat map is faster with this setting.